Hello and welcome, Plates on the Square of Management and Staff. We are Comcast here to offer our services to you. I am the project manager, Cody Brantley. This is George SGS Feely, Rebecca Coward, Crystal Waters, and Emily Coward. George SGS Feely, our VP of Sales, will take the floor. Uh, my name is George Eziashvili and I'm a VP of Sales and I'm going to talk about some problems that uh, network companies experience. Um, start with interrupted connections are one of the most significant problems that network companies experience. Just imagine being in a rush hour and tickets stop sending to the kitchen so people, uh, business stop, start losing money and uh, uh, people that work there get frustrated and people, you can lose a lot of customers like that, lose a lot of money also. Uh, I'm going to talk about next on uh, reliable customer service. Customer service is one of the most important parts of any company, which any questions can be resolved 24-7. And if you have any problem, you can call them and they will answer. Unfriendly and root, uh, unfriendly and unknowledgeable customer service representatives might make your experience bad and a lot of people even will drop their companies because of um, bad customer service and CEO Walmart actually said once that the good uh, as a com company is the goal of, as a company is, is to have customer service that is not just the best but legendary. Um, inconvenient installation times is another uh, inconvenient installation times is another problem with many cable companies because people have work and school and they give you unspecified times and they take forever to install install you where you order so we as a Comcast will not deal with that uh, also inaccessible locations it's, we believe that Comcast is 21st century and the 21st century is a of the world of connected, connected world, and uh, nobody should go without internet or cable in this day of age. And we guarantee that at Comcast. Now, uh, this is Rebecca Coward, VP of Operations. Thank you, George. I'm Rebecca Coward, I'm Vice President of Operations. And here at Comcast, we felt necessary to completely revamp and refocus our efforts towards a total customer satisfaction and how do we do that exactly um, we had a conducted a customer survey um, as you see here um, some example questions that we asked um, to get specific feedback from the customers on what issues they felt needed direct resolution um, from the feedback From the feedback, we um, now have faster, more reliable installation with more convenient installation times. So now, um, when you call up a technician, you won't get a five-hour time window um, for service. You'll now have a specific time of arrival for setup or service updates along those lines, so that way it won't be a hassle or inconvenience to you or your employees. Next, we have our we upgraded our technology to a new state-of-the-art. Um, technology in our field which comes with a lot of exciting features such as our service backup assistance which will automatically kick in if there is ever a drop in your internet or cable or telephone service <coughs> and while simultaneously notifying a technician um, about the problem. Um, next we have we have brought in our range of accessibility um, broaden our range of accessibility so now if you're on vacation or at a conference in Oregon and plates in the, on the square in Atlanta you want to check up and um, see how they're doing on a Friday night you can access your sales records your uh, ticket times anything along those lines and address any <coughs> problems on hand right there in live time instead of waiting until you return to figure out what what we're going um, now I will turn over, turn it over to Crystal Waters, our Vice President of Marketing, to discuss the staff. Hey, hello everyone. Um, at Comcast, the staffing is very important. 
Um, staffing is very important because in, in, in order for us to provide, um, in order for us to provide the services that we're promising you all, we have to ensure that we have the proper staffing to do so. Um, so just to go into further detail about what our staffing, or how our staffing is trained to give you a better idea of our <coughs> security with our company, I'll start off by telling you or informing you that our customers are really not very knowledgeable. Um, they obtain accreditation through the Society of Capable Telecommunication Engineers. And our, technici our technicians are also required to renew these certifications once every year. Also, um, along with these accreditations, our, our, staff is, uh, our staff is also, our staff also must obtain direct training from ex experienced staff. So by that I mean that our technicians, they actually go out with a more experienced staffing or previously a higher employee that they go out to homes and different companies and they are able to gain direct training with these experienced technicians which enables them to be adequate once they are hired. Um, lastly, uh, we are constantly developing our, our IT department at Comcast. This is a major key component to any company or any home. Um, let's just say you're an entrepreneur and you want to make sure that you have the latest technology to keep your business in line with your competitors. Or for, for example, for um, you all, you all have a restaurant. So you want to ensure that your, your customers are going to be able to have the fast internet service. Um, they want to have the latest or every single channel that's available or out at the current moment. And that's something that you won't have to worry about with Comcast. You can, we can guarantee that you will have the latest of everything from the cable service to the internet. Uh, and lastly, our staff is reliable and friendly. They can, they're relatable and they are anxious to assist you. And we also are able, with our staff of over 770, 700,000 enables us to operate a 24-hour service line. So if you have any common or complex questions, we can solve them automatically for you. So this concludes the staffing. I'm going to turn it over to Emily Coward, our president of sales. Thank you. <coughs> Hi, my name is Emily Coward, and I'm the president of sales. And I would like to discuss with you the prices and the costs that you would get um, if you choose Comcast as your network service provider. We offer several deals here at Comcast. Um, one of our deals is um, for new customers that want to sign a contract, we offer a 10% decrease in price um, if you sign for a year. And then um, we also offer deals for customers that don't want to sign a contract. It would be about 5% lower than our average price for that service. And, but you don't have to sign a contract, so um, you wouldn't be locked in with Comcast or if you wanted to change. And then lastly, we offer bundle deals. It would be internet, phone, and cable. Um, for us, this is what we would like to offer plates on the square because it would be two phone lines, um, but also be 60 megabyte per second internet and cable with all eSports networks. And it would be $225 a month. Um, it would be a one-time activation fee of $30 and a one-time installation fee of $50. Um, we like to do the bundle deals because um, as studies show, it is the lowest uh, prices available <coughs> from, from studies from Gregory Crawford. They say it would be about double the average price. And at Comcast, we like to offer the best services, and that begins with offering the very best prices. Just to remind, just to let uh, plates in the square know that if you want to take advantage of this deal, the deadline to get it is July 15th, and that will conclude our presentation portion of today, and we will begin taking questions. Do y'all price match? Yes. If there is a price ma price out there lower than $225 a month for 60 megabyte per second internet, cable with full um, sports, and two phone lines, um, it would we would definitely match that. Uh, you guys offer satellite internet for customers that don't live close to a Comcast location? Yes, we do. Um, as our initiative to provide um, total <coughs> customer satisfaction, we offer a wide variety and different options for um, 
internet and cable access, so that's how internet would be one. Any more questions? If my cable goes on on Saturday night, how long am I going to have to wait to get it back up and started? We promise you that we can get out to you directly Monday through Friday, and Saturday and Sundays, 24 hours a day. Um, our staff of over 700,000 enabled us to cater to you um, directly. Thank you. More questions? Thank you all so much. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>